Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ48, and welcome back to Kingdom of Atham. All right, so we're going to just continue along here and just continue with our quests, with our active quest of getting a land claim block. I went ahead and looked through my inventory, and I noticed I had a woodcutting book of knowledge. Uh, plus 500 woodcutting uh, profession experience. Instantly gained 500 experience. Um, I'm going to do that, and let's just read this. Cool. All right, beautiful. No fuss, no muss. Let's take a look at it now. All right, so we are at level, we're at Lumberjack level four, which is awesome. Um, we're at minor level one. Um, horta, horticultist? I don't know what the hell that is. Uh, <laughs> I don't know how I'm getting experience from that either. Augment horticulturist. I'm not even going to try. Uh, resource gain. Uh, I don't know what that is, but I'm level two of it, so that's pretty fun. So I went ahead and gathered a bunch of wood uh, because you need a lot of it for the land claim block. So we're going to go ahead and make the land claim block now. I just have to find it. I think it's in my inventory. Nope, not there. Where is that land claim block? I know I saw it somewhere. There it is. And I, like I said, 50 wood, man. Super duper expensive. I already have like 40 something wood on me. So I also got to do my finish my roof at some point. I don't know how I'm going to do this part of the roof, but I will figure that out off camera because, um, well, I don't know how I'm going to do it. It might take some time. So uh, where do I want to put this? Am I supposed to put this inside? Can you put this on foundations? Uh, yes, you can. So I guess I should just put it right in my house, right? I guess this is a pretty good spot for it. Why not? I don't even know what that does. I, actually, I guess I could read it. Um, great. Now I got to find where it was again. <laughs> there it is. Land claim is used for claiming a piece of land so the only authorized... Yeah, so I'm single player. This does nothing for me. Uh, so that's fine. Uh, craft a defensive plan. Ooh, that sounds interesting. Defensive plan. Okay, 20 fiber. Do I have it? I do not. Let's go ahead and get some more fiber. Maybe kill another wolf. I don't think I'm going to kill any more wolves right now. Uh, well, I'll kill some more at some point. Just not right now. I just want to get to uh, do the quest. You know, it's kind of weird. These quests are... um, The order of these quests seem a little weird. I, I would have had the player make a bed by now. Like, easily by now. Because spawn point's really important. I also feel like making a campfire might have been important by now. Uh, I'm hoping I can make some kind of food that will help me get uh, energy back quicker. Because my energy, like, takes forever, forever to come back. So, uh, what the hell was I making next? Oh, yeah. Defensive plan. Oh, missing two. All right. So, we should be able to come over here and grab another couple. And don't forget, the last time I fought the... When I did fight the, you know, the wolf, the only reason he killed me last episode was because uh, I just didn't, you know, have... All my energy. You really want to make sure you have all your energy before you fight these things. Otherwise, it's not going to go your way. Well, who knows? Maybe it will, but it, maybe it won't. Even with the bow. Um, the bow seem, the bow does feel good, though. Uh, it does feel good. So, All right, build and place a fence and wood spikes. Okay. So, I'm going to take this. Defensive plan. All right, so we've got fencing... Wood spiked wall, wooden wall, metal spikes, and wooden spikes. All right, that threw me for a bit of a loop. I couldn't build the wood fencing, right? I'm like, why can't I build the wood fencing? It's got to be on foundations. Okay, so which one's supposed to be the... Uh, is that supposed to be the outside? I think that's supposed to be the outside. Because you see how it goes more of a foundation? Like that, it's kind of like off the foundation. See, that's kind of like off of it. But I was thinking maybe those are like kind of like spikes. I don't know what those are. I'm going to build it like this, but I'm not really sure which way they're supposed to go, to be honest. There we go. And now let's make ourselves some spikes. I don't know, let's put it right there, I guess. All right, now we make a campfire. Yeah, see, I would have I made a campfire a while ago. But, eh, what the hell do I know? Um, can you make the campfire in here? I thought you could, but yeah, you can. It's right there. All right, there we go. Now, can I put that inside? I gotta, I gotta fix this roof because I want to get rid of those stairs. <laughs> um, where am I gonna put my campfire? Will it burn down the place? I don't know. Let's see what it says. Perfect for cooking meat, staying warm, and providing light. Okay, doesn't say anything about burning down your house. So, hopefully, we won't have any issues here. But you never know. Um, eh, put it right over here, I guess. Okay, and then I uh, craft a furnace and place that as well. 
All right, now I think the furnace is in here. Yep, right there. Um, do I have that? I don't know. Let's find out. <laughs> Apparently, I do. <laughs> well, while that's getting uh, made up, let's go ahead and see what we can do with the roof here. Just out here minding my own business, and I got a dog trying to kill me. So let's see exactly what good this uh, building is going to do me. Whoops. Okay, so he's attacking my spikes. Are the spikes doing damage to him? I don't know. All right, let's see if we can kill him before he breaks my stuff. Seems to be taking some pretty decent damage. I can't tell if the... Uh, oh, yeah, the spikes are... I think the spikes are damaging him. Oh, yeah, they definitely were. Cool. So the spikes are cool. And not only will the spikes damage him, but he attacks the spikes. That is really, really good. Now, why would he attack the spikes? I have no idea. I figured he'd rather come up on my uh, thing and kill me. But, hey, man, uh, I like the fact that he's attacking the spikes. Who knows? Maybe I've got some kind of wolf scent thing on the spikes. Anyway, I went ahead and um, I couldn't destroy anything up here. I wanted to destroy uh, certain parts of this so I could get into different parts. I'm going to redesign the roof a little bit. I couldn't destroy it. And the reason I couldn't destroy it, if I could get out of here, I will show you why. Is because when you make a land claim block, you've got to go to the land claim block and click on it. So you go ahead and click on the land claim block. You can see right there, it says um, deauthorize. And then it says one of five players. That's because when I clicked on the button, it made me authorized. And then I could destroy stuff. Okay. And that's what I did. And I'm working on the roof to make the roof more cool. All right. I'm just learning the roof techniques uh, of building in this game. Every single survival game has different building techniques, especially when it comes to roof pieces. So I'm still learning it. And um, there's no flat pieces on the roof up there, but I can't get up there right now, which is fine. I'll make a way for me to get up there at some point. Um, let's get back to the quest. Okay, so I went ahead and made a furnace. And there it is right there. Number seven. And we'll put that bad boy right here. Uh, yeah, it seems like a good spot for it. And then what is the uh, precise rotation control? Okay, that looks pretty good to me. All right. Uh, let's put it more that way, more that way. All right, there we go. Collect fine sand, coarse sand, and clay. Okay, Do you, are you going to tell me where to get any of that stuff? All right, so apparently I got to make a mortar. So let's go ahead and do that now. Uh, there's not a lot of info in the game as far as I can tell. Like, I went to the quest journal to look up the info. I couldn't find anything about where to get this stuff. I went and asked on Discord. Um, so I will bring that up to the developers. Uh, it, uh, I might be missing the info somewhere. I very well might be. But if I'm not, I'm going to bring it up to the developers that, you know, if you want a mortar, you know, to make the sand and stuff we're going to need, um, that quest should be before the quest to get the sand, you know. Uh, so little things like that. That's why we're testing the game, right? All right. I'm just going to put this thing. Right. I, I kind of wish I could go in first person, too. I'm not going to lie. Uh, all right, whatever. That's fine. All right, so let's take a look. At, oh, look at all this stuff we can make. So we can make sulfur, fire, fiber oil, dragon claw powder, all kinds of dragon claw stuff, trail powder. Man, look at all this crap I can make. Black dyes, clay. There's some clay. So I need fine sand. So I think I should be able to make that. Got some sugar in here. Um, there's some sand. Okay. And coarse sand is flint and stone. All right. How many am I going to have to make? 15? Okay. So let's just make 15 of each for now. We'll kind of see where we go from there. 15 of that. Um, Six stone, huh? I thought I had more stone now. I wonder if I've been using my stone on other things. All right. Well, let's go ahead and make this then. Uh, oh, the result. Of, oh, okay. So you get five, five per. Okay. So three will be good enough. All right. And then three. All right. Beautiful. Okay, so regular sand is fine sand, as far as I can tell. Uh, when you just make regular sand, it'll come out as fine sand. So you can see right there that popped out, fine sand. Okay? Now, in order to make clay, I'm going to need coarse sand or fine sand and a filled flask. Now, in order to make the flask, you can make them in here. I'm going to go ahead and turn this off because I already made some flasks. Um, I've got some empty flasks here. And I'm assuming... I'm assuming I could just take this to the water and wait, why can't I put transparent a product of sand melting? Yeah. Well, how do I fill it up? If I can't put it on my hot bar. All right. Well, let's, let's go to the um, water side and see if we can fill it up somehow. Um, but I, I, yeah, I think I need this thing filled with water. So let's come into the water. Oh boy. Okay. Good. You can swim. I was getting nervous there. 
Okay, right clicking isn't doing anything, near, neither is left clicking. And I can't put it in my hopper, so I'm not really sure how it gets, how I get water in here. Okay, I'm learning. I am learning. In order to, uh, oh, can I pick that up? What do you get for that? Three? That's not bad. That's not bad at all. I'm going to hit some uh, stone now. Uh, yeah, in order to fill up the flasks, you need a well. As far as I can tell, you cannot fill them in the river. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and make a well. In order to make a well, I'm going to need a lot more stone. So I'm going to come out here, grab some stone. I don't know what stone, what kind of stone that is. I'm assuming that's iron. I tried to hit it with a pick and it didn't do anything. So I'm assuming I need like a better pickaxe. So we've got the, we've got the fine sand collected. We've got the coarse sand collected. We just need to get ourselves a well, fill up our flasks, and then we should be able to make clay. So yeah, that, all right. Well, hey, we're learning, right? That's why you come to a KJ for it video. Now you're not going to have to str struggle through this stuff. Um, if there's one thing I would like to see in this game sooner rather than later, it's explanations on how to do a lot of this stuff. Because, uh, man, if it wasn't for Discord, like, I'd be screwed. Um, again, this information might be in the game somewhere. I'm very new to it. But I have looked through the through the quest journal. I could not find any information about any of this stuff. Um, so I'm thinking it's not there. I also, I also asked people on Discord... And they said they couldn't find the information in the game either. I don't like to just assume it's definitely not going to be there. You know, I, I miss stuff all the time. But I am not finding it yet. That's faux show. Sure. All right. So let's come on in here. And let's see if we have what we need for the well. Uh, right here. And well. Beautiful. And we'll place that sucker down, grab some water out of it. So that kind of defeats the whole purpose of living by the water. I purposely came over to this area because I was like, well, it's a survival game. Living by the water is important. Well, you know, hey, at least I got a good view. And it's not a bad place to live. It's not like I'm, uh, you know, in a lot of danger here. It's crazy or anything. It's, it's a nice place to live. So we're going to go ahead and put down a well. And I guess I'll just put it over here. Actually, uh, I'm trying to think about which way I'm going to expand. I'm going to put it in the back. So I don't think I'm going to expand in the back. Right. Anytime soon. Maybe right down here. Just in case I want to expand a little bit. Okay. All right. Here we go. Uh, so water buckets. We've got water buckets. Filled bottle. That's a wine bottle. And there's the flask. And we'll take it right out of inventory. And it will. Beautiful. Um, I think we're going to need one more of those. Did I make three flasks? I think I did. Yes, I did. Cool. Oops, I got to take it. All right, cool. And then once we have these flasks, we should be able to make uh, the amount of clay we're going to need. So let's come in here and let's go to clay. And I don't know if it matters which kind of sand we use. I guess I'll just use fine. And there's the 15 and we need more fine sand. Do we have the coarse sand? Okay, we do. Screw it. I'll just use the coarse sand. I don't I don't care. We got our clay. Clay for days. All right. Craft an empty flask. See, these, these quests are definitely ass backwards. Because <laughs> I should have been crafting that already. Um, so, all right. So, what does that take? That says fine sand. All right. So, we're going to need some more fine sand. Like, actually, we're going to need quite a bit of fine sand. And fine sand is just regular sand. Uh, how many stone do I have? Do I only have 10 stone? Really? Oh, that's right. I used a lot of it for the for the um, thingy. All right. Fair enough. Um, I will just use all 10. We'll get a bunch of fine sand. Should be a good amount of fine sand. And then we'll turn that. Actually, um, is 25 going to be enough for the flasks? Uh, how many did I need? I don't remember. Um, five? Actually, that might be enough. Five times five, right? It takes five each. Beautiful. There we go. Ooh, iron ingots. Hell yeah. We got to turn this thing on. We got to put some uh, put some wood in there. I've been putting um, branches in there because I don't really like use them that much right now. I mean, maybe I will later, but I definitely don't use branches a lot. Also, do I have points to spend? Uh, no. Okay. All right. The, the empty flesh is really hard to see. Looks like something I'm going to use to make meth with. <laughs> maybe. I don't know. All right, one more, and then we'll go fill them up. And five, and turn off. And then empty bot. Oh, craft empty bot. Oh, wants me to do the wine, too. I wonder what the difference is. They're just bottles, right? Um, how much coarse sand do I have? Probably not enough. Yeah, because I used it for the clay. 
Just having a little bit of a sit down, get my uh, energy back. And now I'm going to come in here and I will dump in the coarse sand. And we will make five of these bad boys. Uh, where is, not planks. Where's my wood? Where's the wood I like to, uh, I like to burn. Wait, no, seriously, where is it? Oh, oh it's right there. Okay. All right, turn that on. Let's craft five of those. And uh, I don't know, again, I don't know what the difference is. Uh, used to make potions, used to make wine. Okay, so you can't, you can't make wine in this. You can't make potions in this. Got it. Got it. I wonder what wine is for. I wonder if you actually get stats for it. Or if it's just like a, you know, you got a drink type of thing. Who knows? All right, four and five. There we go. Uh, craft a well. Ugh. Do I really have to craft another well? Oh my goodness. Yeah, they, they really got to put these things in order because now I can't do anything until I craft another well. Ugh. Oh, goodness. I don't think I got anything back for that either. I'm pretty sure I'm not going to have what I need to craft another well, but let's take a look. Uh, okay. Maybe I did get something back for it and I, did, I didn't see it, but um, I, I literally didn't see it. I think I want to um see. I want to go off script and build what I want to build, but at the same time, I don't. Because then when the quest comes along for me to build that next thing, I'm going to have to waste resources to build it again. So I guess I'll just do exactly what they say. There we go. And fill the flasks. Got it. And... Um, I can't really see what I do this. I can't see what's in there. All right. So it, it says to fill both, right? Yes. Nope, don't punch it. All right. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, water skins. Okay, so water is not going to be a problem anymore. And honestly, with my ability to kill the wolves, that probably won't be a problem either. All right. Craft mortar. Place. Mm. Oh, you son of a biscuits. All right. Let me craft the mortar again. Uh, where was it? Where was it? Mortar, mortar, mortar. Is up at the top, wasn't it? There it is. Now, at least that one's cheap, although I still don't have the wood. Okay, so I went ahead and made the mortar and the alchemical station, which was an alchemy station. I think it's the same thing. Um, I went ahead and set up a alchemy station that came out as an alchemical station. Um, it also says to make one of each, so uh, I'm assuming they're the same thing. Okay, so... Oh, yeah, one is place and one is craft. Okay, I thought they both said craft. So that, that's my bad. Or maybe they did and they just kind of... No, no, it said place and craft. All right, fair enough. Fair enough. So let's go ahead and place this sucker. And see how big this thing is? Uh, it's not so bad. Uh, I just can't really see that well. Eh, it's fine. All right, there we go. Now we need to collect blue, green, and red mushrooms. I wonder, That's a lot of mushrooms to gather. Oh, here we go. We got potions now. Ice meteor. Whoa, what the hell are these? One scroll of knowledge. What? Both containing power of... Whoa. I wonder where I get these... I wonder where I get the gems from. Um, energy potion. Uh, okay, yeah. All right. I just don't know where to get the gems. So... All right, let's come on out here and let's, um, I think I'm going to kill a wolf or maybe for some food. I see enough apples. Shouldn't be that big of a deal. So let's just come out here and gather some more, uh, I'm, I'm assuming if the trees grow back every 15 to 30 minutes, then the mushrooms are the same thing. So we'll do some exploring, gathering some mushrooms, and hopefully we don't get killed. All right, we got a wolf over here I'm going to want to fight. So let's see if we can take this guy out. Oh, aiming too high. And I got nothing done. Okay. Uh, looks like we're gonna... Yeah, this is not a good start. I'm still getting used to the bow. They aggro from really far away. Damn, man. I can't stop from getting hit. Yeah, now I'm out of stamina. And now I... Oh, I got him! Wow, barely. <laughs> I'll take it. I will take it. Uh, what do I could use blood for? I have no idea. 
But now I got to be careful. Yeah, they aggro from a lot farther away than I thought. And I'm still getting used to the bow. Uh, I think you can make a targeting dummy. I might actually uh, kind of mess around with that a little bit. Let's go ahead and grab some. Oh, eh, I don't really need any food. All right, let's go ahead and get some drink. What the hell is that? Okay, yeah. If that thing aggroes me, I'm screwed. I saved the game like right like right before I attacked that wolf, so I'll just kind of come over here. If worse comes to worse, I'll either come back and get my corpse or I'll reload. I don't know if there's any kind of death penalty. Man, look at that freaking thing. I don't know what that is, but it can't be good. It cannot be good, my friends. Okay. All right, well, we're harvesting ourselves some... Uh, some mushrooms here. It's going. It's going pretty quick. You get like I think I got like eight at some point in one. Of, let's see how many mushrooms I get. Yeah, seven. It seems random. I would say if I had to guess, they were between six and maybe six and eight. Right, I really need to get some uh, energy back. So let me go ahead and sit down and chill out for a minute. All right, there's two wolves outside my door, trying to break in. So that kind of sucks. Um, one of them's got a yellow name too. So we'll just kind of see how this goes. See, I don't even think I'm hitting him. I think I'm hitting my own place. Oh, there we go. Alright, I'm probably gonna die here. Now, is he just gonna, like, spawn camp me? I saved the game, so it's not the end of the world, but... Yeah, is he gonna, like, spawn camp me? I mean, like... <laughs> what do I do at this point? Yeah, he's still there. I wonder if there's a penalty. Oh, he's dead? How did he die? Is there like I wonder if there's a bleeding effect on my attacks? Take all and take all. Can't fit everything. Wait, why can't I fit? Every oh, you only have so much room. Oh goodness. All right, can I just um right click? Nope. So I could probably put that on there. Yep. Okay. This is gonna take a little bit. Ah, uh, by the way, um, <laughs> whatever their names are that color, that means they're harder to kill. They're tougher. So. I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to do here, but I think I'm, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to die again. But I'll try and take him out as much as I can, and, um, you know, we'll see how it goes. Come on. Come on, buddy. There you go. You're going to die. You're going to die. So that guy was harder, supposedly harder than the other guy, but I killed him easier. That was odd. Okay. And then there's another one right there, um, but I'm going to need some health. All right, so if I was just asking in Discord about health. Um, apparently, the best way to make health is to make health potions, uh, which is going to take 10 red mushrooms and one filled flask. Now, uh, mushroom powder. Oh, I don't make mushroom powder. It's got to be in here. Sulfur, fiber, mushroom powder. Is it? Yeah, red mushroom powder. All right, so it's a one for one. All right. Well, I don't want to. I don't want to like use it just yet because I want to complete that quest. I think what I'm going to do, guys, is next episode I'm going to go off quest and I'm going to start. Um, I'm going to start thinking about longevity of hit points. I've got my food situation taken care of. As a matter of fact, speaking of food, while I'm sitting down here and waiting, I'm going to uh, cook up some food. So uh, let's take all of that and then we will put up in there to cook, sort, and we are looking for the planks. There we go. And raw meat, there we go. Turn on. And we should be able to make 15. What is that, 15? Okay. All right, cool. This stuff does give health back too, which is nice. Oh, no, it doesn't. Oh, okay. Well, never mind. Anyway, you want to keep your hunger and your thirst up as, as much as possible. Because uh, the, the higher it is, the more health you'll gain back. So, what I'm going to do is, for next episode, I'm going to look into making farm plots. Okay? Uh, I think I saw them in here somewhere. Um, I think there's like standing, yeah, there's standing planters, and uh, there's also ground planters. It's exactly the same, so I guess it's just a, um, you know, which one looks cooler. I'm gonna look into, um, I'm gonna look into planting because uh, basically what I want to do is, I want to start getting, I want to start planting red mushrooms, getting them growing because right now I can't really fight because every fight I get into, I've got no health and I just have to sit around and wait. And yeah, you could eat the red mushrooms, but the amount of hit points you get is so so low. Uh, I wouldn't, I wouldn't. Uh, wait, do I have any red mushrooms? I must. Yeah, there they are. They don't look red to me, but... Um, yeah, one hit point back. I mean, that's that's nothing. That's basically nothing. Uh, now, if I turn that into powder, will it not have a, um... Will, will it not, like, uh, have a spoil time anymore? Uh, well, let's see. 
Uh, red powder. Oh, okay, cool. So, all right. You know, the only thing that sucks, though, is it takes it away from my quest line. But I think I'm going to do that because I don't want to let these spoil. Especially the red ones. All right. I'm going to... Um, yeah, let's just... Uh, let's go ahead and do that. And let's just turn those all to powder so we don't lose any. Because they will spoil. I know it's going to take a while. But still, I'd rather have the red mushroom powder so I can make some healing potions. Because right now, I can't fight. Because when I fight, I have to sit down for like 10 minutes just to get all my hit points back. So that's not going to work for me. So I think the next thing we need to do is um, keep our hunger and thirst as high as possible. And in the meantime, start working towards hit point potions, which is going to take us a lot of red mushroom. All right. Forgot about the fire. <laughs> uh, well, you can't burn stuff, so that's good. At least as far as I can tell. All right, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to uh, put that right there. And we're going to go ahead and eat that. And just get up to max health. I don't even care if I lose a little bit of the food. Uh, we got our food situation taken care of. We got our we got our thirst taken care of. We've got a shelter. Those are the, the That's a trifecta of survival. Now if we want to fight, we need to start making potions. And in order to make potions, I'm going to need... In order to make potions, I'm going to need those uh, red shrooms. So we're going to get a farm going next episode. For sure. Yeah, we're definitely going to die here. This is like a... like I don't know if this is a boss-like creature, but you could tell by its name that it's it's stronger, you know, <laughs> than a normal wolf, for sure. I don't know if I like them trying to corpse camp me either, but... Alright, come on. Get off my freaking thing. Come on. Oh, he's not doing a lot of damage to it. Never mind. I could just punch him to death. It'll take a while, but I can do it. Can I chill down the button? Yeah. Oh. Okay. There we go. Um, I wonder if I can repair my base. If I, I, I'm sure I can. I just don't know how. And you're dead. Punk ass freaking wolf. That's what you get. All right. Take all there. Take all there. I can't do it. Let me just go ahead and put all my stuff on. You know, let's look the wolf first. What you got? Okay, so basic stuff. He just got more of it. Okay, fair enough. All right, guys. I think what I'm going to do now is I'm going to loot everything, organize, and get ready to make myself a farm. And uh, like I said, that is going to be my priority next episode. If you guys end up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.